Good morning, everyone. This is Tony Sassy T from the 803. How are you guys doing? I'm doing well. I'm doing well on my way to the J-O-B to make that M-O-N-E. Why? Because I got bills to play and vacations to slay. Okay? But anyway, before we get started, remember all things on this channel. It is alleged. It is um, for entertainment purposes only. It is for learning, teaching, and we're going to learn some stuff, and we're going to teach some stuff, okay? It is for uh, laughing and to be enjoyable, uplifting, nothing negative, okay? But anyway, um, before we get started, y'all know the drill. Thank you guys for my, thank you to my new subscribers. Welcome to the Tribe Called Tea. Um, if you want to give to the channel, of course, you know what to do. Cash App, the whole sign tree, 12, super stickers, super hearts, emojis, and all that jazz, okay? Please subscribe to the backup channel. We will be dealing with mental health month this month over there, and I will have a lot of great topics we're going to talk about starting this weekend, all right? So, we're going to talk about the scene um, of Martel at the birthday party, which was very troubling, and I cannot believe that they would even put this mess on TV. Now, Mel, you know I love you, I do, but this right here is very troubling. Um, I don't think that <laughs> Martel and Mel need to work together. Um, <clears throat> I know she's trying, and I know she wants to see him eat, but Martel's a grown ass man now. And he need to find his way. Um, I'm, I'm saying that because he is going to mess around and catch a case. That's what's going to happen to Martia. I'm sorry, yeah. Um, <clears throat> because the way he was up in, I don't know who face it looked like Miss Van for a minute. Then it looked like somebody else. I couldn't tell who he was up in the face with, but it was threatening, and uh, he was he was in a rage, okay, but Mel did the right thing, she tried to calm him down, she got out of his way, um, she talked in a, a soothing voice, um, that's what you have to do with narcissists, and I, and let's be clear, when I say narcissist, I'm not clinically diagnosing uh, this man, but he sure has a lot of tendencies of a narcissist, and, and last when I saw that video, it seems to me he had a narcissistic rage. And the only way you can deal with that is you can't get rage for yourself because it escalates. You have to de-escalate. You have to talk to him in a uh, nice way. You have to be calm and you have to get out of their way. Okay? Um, <clears throat> so, um, Martel had walked in and um, Mel had stopped him at the door. And he was like, she she was telling him, I have invited you to birthday parties before he never showed up. Um, in fact, he didn't show up to last year because he was up at um, Arion's son's sister birthday, La Ninja birthday party, La, La Five Degrees, so like, hey, uh, La Five Bill. He um, was up to um, <clears throat> Paris's birthday party. And he missed his own daughter's birthday party to be in that birthday, to be seen, to try to make Mel mad. But it didn't do anything but make him look worse than he already looked, okay? He was going off screaming to the top of his natural boy voice, sounding like a coyote in heat, all right? When I say this joker, was chicken necking and shoulders up like he was getting ready to buck. Baby, that was very troubling to see. And Carlos King don't get it. He gets it, but he don't care. Okay? He would do it as long as he can get away with it. Um, It's sad. It's disturbing that this psychotic of a man is on this show running his mouth right there up in a woman's face up in a woman's face for no reason because he wasn't invited because he don't know how to act now you pick me oh she should have invited him well y'all better go back to the sugar shack and look at how this fool has acted 
okay? Because no, he didn't come for the last several birthday parties. Why he want to come now? He got, and like Mel said, you can get her the rest of the day. This is something I wanted to do for her. Not only was he in there acting a fool, but his kids had to see it. His daughters had to see a man buck up on a woman and you think this is okay. Hmm. Well, you know, Carlos, I hate to tell you, it ain't okay. Okay? It ain't okay. It's not. Um, it's a bad look for own. It's a bad look for this show. Okay? Uh, <clears throat> it's a bad look, period. Martel, he, he, he goes too far. Too far. And he's had so many chances. Too many chances, in my opinion. He has had too many chances. He cannot redeem himself. He's a ticking time bomb who has issues with women. Just like you, Carlos King. You have issues with women. He needs to figure out why he hates his mama so much. Okay? Because that's what it is. He'll say he loves his mama. Maybe true. But you got some kid injury, some kid trauma, and some kid and some young boy hate towards his mom. And it's coming out in his grown-up behavior. In his grown-up life. I'm sorry. It really is. And it's a sad thing. Somebody is going to mess around and get hurt. And their own is going to be out of own. Somebody going to own own. Okay? So, I hope and pray that they get this under control. Because right now, it's out of control. Uh, Martel is out of control. He has no, whew, how can I say it? He has no compassion for women. He has no restraints. He doesn't know his boundaries. He doesn't know how to hear the word no. And unfortunately, you see the same traits in Lenox. You really do. You have to call a spade a spade and what it is, what it is. Because his mom don't put any boundaries on him. That's my son. Holt, that's my boy. Be sweet. Can't be sweet. He's a boy. Girls be sweet. Boys be boys. Be respectful. Let's not do that. Or I will pop you or put you in time out. Learn something. Because then he's going to grow up being just like his daddy. And you know what? Some women like that. That's why I call them the pygmies. They like this type of man because they think this type of behavior is love. Honey, love don't blow up at you like that. All right? That's not love. That man don't even love himself. So he can't even love you. All right? He can't love you because he can't love himself. And when I say he can't love himself, he can't love the inner self. Only thing he like is his image. And he really hate that. That's why he works on it so hard to improve his image and his teeth and his smile. And he rehearses his lines, how he's going to come off to women every single day. Because he knows the inside of him is nothing. He's hollow. He's ratchet. He's rotten. And he's disgusted. He's lower than a good. Okay? He's lower. He's lower than a full pie. All right? Oh, y'all. I can't do Martell. But anyway, you guys, let me know what you think about that scene. All right, comment below. Keep me in the algorithm, yo. Hit the like button. Share, 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 share the video. All right, if you can't share the whole video, share clips of the video. All right, get your friends and your cousins to, aunts and uncles to subscribe to the channel. They will enjoy it. All right, you guys, have a great day, and I will see you guys tonight at 730. Bye.